here are some relationships between probability distributions of random variables. A gamma distribution is a generalization of the exponential. An exponential has what we call a scale parameter, but the gamma also has alpha, a shape parameter. And the density is y to the alpha minus 1 e to the minus y over beta times a normalizing constant. There are two important special cases. If alpha equals 1, then y is exponential. If alpha is n over 2 and beta is 2, we get a chi-square. That is the definition of a chi-square distribution. If z has a standard normal distribution, z squared turns out to be chi-square distributed with one degree of freedom. This can be proven with moment generating functions. If you have a set of independent standard normal random variables, the sum of their squares is a chi-square distribution with n degrees of freedom. If you have a chi-square with new degrees of freedom and standard normal, then t equals z over square root of the chi-square divided by its number of degrees of freedom. That is a t-distribution with new degrees of freedom. An f-distribution, you have a chi-square with n1 degrees and a chi-square with n2 degrees. You divide them by their degrees of freedom and then divide them by each other, and that is an f-distribution n1, n2 are the numerator and denominator degrees of freedom. Based on all that, if you look at t squared, you would get z squared over w over n2, and z squared is a chi-square with one degree of freedom, and you can divide it by one, and w over n2. So that is, by definition, an f distribution with one numerator degree of freedom and n2 denominator degrees of freedom.